Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another video for you guys. And in this class, I'm going to be guiding you through a stretch and strengthening routine. We're going to be doing the stretching aspect to lengthen your muscles and the strengthening side, we're going to be holding on to certain poses to improve your muscle tone and strength. No equipment needed for the class, just yourself and a mat. And once you're ready, hop onto it and let's begin. I want you to sit to the center of the mat as you open your legs out nice and wide. Flex the foot underneath and just stay to the point where it feels comfortable. And now I want you to tuck your butt cheeks off the mat. Just slide your palms down to your butt cheeks and open it out and that way you're sitting nice and tall on your pubic bone. As we slide the right hand down to your leg, you're going to stretch for the left side body QL stretch. and switch sliding for the left and stretching for the right side. And going in for a mid back stretch, take your right hand behind, cut across your left to your knee, turn it gaze behind to the point where you feel your back is stretching. And take the time to switch this time stretching for the left side and feeling the stretch on your mid back and we're going to crawl ourselves to the center forward just fold yourself forward drop your head down so I want you to just stop to the point if you're not able to reach down it's completely fine as long as you keep reaching forward going in for the forward release And slowly walk back to the midline now you're going to slowly raise yourselves to the tabletop position on all fours take your time and find yourselves comfortable in this position starting off with some cat and cow stretches I want you to slowly arch your back and gaze up to the ceiling just holding it here for the back stretch inhale here and exhale try to curl yourselves down chin drops down to the chest reaching your spine up to the ceiling inhaling up For a big exhale, curl yourselves down. Go in for this spinal wave at your very own pace. No need to rush up or no need to even follow me. Just do this at your very own pace. I'm sure you're feeling a lot better as you do this move. It's going to remove all the aches, stiffness and tightness on your back. As you are in the curled position, I want you to rock yourselves back and forth. Just tiny little pulsing move forward and back, not too much, as long as you feel relieving your back. Moving on for some core strengthening work, I want you to bring your legs together inside 
and your hands are right underneath the shoulder blades. Once you're ready, I want you to extend your left leg off the mat, point the toes underneath, make sure your leg is parallel to the ground and your body is in a straight line. And if you are losing balance, you can drop your leg down at any point of time and just get back to the core holds. And take the time to switch, this time stretching for the right leg. Put the focus on your core and keep breathing. Never hold on to your breath. Get that airflow in and out. This time, I want you to extend for your left leg to the side. Open it nice and wide, stretching for your hip. Beautiful stretch here. And once you're ready, plant your right hand down to the mat. Press it down as you reach your left up to the ceiling. Turn and gaze up if you can, opening up for the chest. And once you're good here, you're going to drop the hand down towards the other side, inside and reach up. Drop it down, curl yourselves underneath, not necessarily twisting. Just try to reach down if you can, feeling good in this stretch and strengthening move. And take the time to switch this time extending for the right leg to the side and get comfortable opening up for the hip flexor and once again, good reach for the right right hand up to the ceiling and just holding it here opening up for the chest and your hips And now get ready to drop down, fold yourselves down, tuck it in and extend and reach. Inhale, tuck it in. Exhale, reach. Keep going. I hope you're feeling a lot stronger and stretched out already we just have a couple of more feel good core strengthening work to do you're still on the all fours position we are going to be doing the bird dog i want you to extend your left leg parallel to the mat point the toes underneath and once you find your balance no hurry at all i want you to lift your right hand as well so that's going to be opposite limbs your left and your right arm and now you're just going to hold it here keep breathing Slowly drop down, take the time to switch. Extending for the right leg and this time finding balance with your left arm. Beautiful core strengthening work. Great work, slowly reaching back down to your elbows. Just going in for a stretch, close your fist and just circle it out for all the work that you did on your palms. Reverse the circles. Now open all your fingers out and just go in for rotations.
We just have a couple of more moves to go for this one. I want you to still stay onto your elbows. I want you to open your legs out wider. Pelvic rotations. Watch the move. I'm just going in for mild circles with my hips to massage your pelvic region, your hip flexors, your back, your spinal cord to strengthen and to stretch everything out and to feel good. And let's reverse the circles, take it to the other direction. And few more stretches to wrap up this class. I want you to go in for the puppy dog stretch still onto the elbows. You're simply going to gaze up to the point where you feel the stretch. Beautiful stretch this is to unwind and relax your body. And once you're ready, we're going in for the child's resting pose. You're going to open your legs out and you're going to reach your glutes down towards your leg. And extend the arms in front and you're going to stay here until you hear the last and final beep in the child's resting pose. And slowly as we raise ourselves up onto the all fours, I want you to get yourselves to lie down, back resting comfortably down to the mat. Tuck your knees in towards your chest. And we're thinking to rock ourselves back and forth, nice and slow to get a nice massage for your lower back. And let's think to sway left and right to the sides as we get that angle as well, passively massaging for your back. Legs down, I want you to lift your right leg off the mat, nice and up straight. Flex and point your toes underneath at your very own pace, slow and precise. And now as we think to circle out for the ankles in one direction, try to flex your toes as much as you can. And switching for the other leg, try to lift your left leg up this time. Flex and point the toes underneath once you're ready. Now once you're good, let's circle out for the ankle. Nice and slow, big circles, as deep as you can get. Walk 
going in for the supine mid back stretch you're going to drop both your legs down to one side of the room and you're just going to hold it here beautiful stretch on your mid back is felt i really hope you guys feel it if you don't try to twist your body as much as you can till you feel the stretch you can even take one leg over to the other and look up to the other side to the other shoulder in that way getting that nice deep stretch growing with the stretch and take the time to switch this time dropping both your legs down to the other side And you can even take one leg over to the other. Extending for the arm and looking towards the side. And let's get the legs to the butterfly pose, your feet together, your knees apart, so that your legs are in a diamond shape. You can guide your hands down to your inner thighs if you want to. And thinking to flap your knees out for the butterfly flaps. Stay here, feeling that stretch on your groin, your inner thighs. And one last final stretch as always, I want you to extend your legs down, interlace your hands and take your arms right over your head. You're going to give yourselves a full body stretch from head to toe, arching your back and giving every part of your body a feel good stretch. Well done you guys, that's the end of this video. I really hope that you enjoyed this flow with me and that you felt stronger, more stretched out and feeling good. If you like this video, do thumbs it up and leave me your thoughts in the comments below and I will be back with more at home workout videos for you guys in the coming weeks. Thank you so much for tuning in. Until next time, stay fit, healthy and happy.